Pennsylvania nursing homes have reached a big milestone when it comes to vaccinating the state's most vulnerable population. But one local state senator says Pennsylvania still has a long way to go. WBRE 28 WIOU 22 Eyewitness News reporter Julie Dunphy joins us in Wilkesbury live with the story. Julie. More than 600 skilled nursing facilities in Pennsylvania have given both residents and staff both doses of the coronavirus vaccine. State Senator John Udichak says while the federal pharmacy partnership has been successful within the state of Pennsylvania, there's more to be done. The rollout of the vaccine has been frustrating for many, but the governor announced Tuesday the news for older Pennsylvanians gets better. 100% of Pennsylvania seniors living in care homes who wanted a vaccine have received at least one dose. This is an important milestone for Pennsylvania, and it marks key progress in ensuring that our most vulnerable residents get the vaccines soon and quickly. So I have been critical of the Department of Health uh, the federal pharmacy partnership, however, has has worked very well. CVS and Walgreens helped the state by vaccinating people at long term care and skilled nursing facilities, plus personal care homes and those in assisted living. This long term care vaccination mission included the distribution of more than 315,000 vaccines. But State Senator John U. D. Chak says it's not enough. Phase 1A is four and a half million people. That means 9 million doses of the vaccine are required. We've only administered 3 million uh, doses here in Pennsylvania. We are well behind many other states, still ranking 42nd out of 50 states. We need to do better. Pennsylvania has one of the largest populations of older adults in the nation. Senator Udichak's main concern now is those over 65 are not all able to navigate the website or secure a vaccine location. We got to make sure that we have a plan to get to those senior high rises, to get to uh, healthcare facilities that aren't on the list uh, of phase one at this moment. We need to get to those residents and make sure that they're protected with this life saving vaccine. Now, there are talks of mass vaccination sites, but lawmakers say they are not ready to go just yet because we don't have enough doses allocated to us from the federal government. For now, reporting in Wilkes-Barre, Julie Dunphy, WBRE 28, WYOU 22, Eyewitness News. And the House and Senate just passed a bill to have the Pennsylvania National Guard join in on the vaccination effort. And that has been sent to the governor's desk for his signature.